All right, so we got we got basically stuff going on on all fronts right now. Every single person is involved in some kind of drama. Oh, here we go. Oh, but I didn't get to make her hair and dress. Oh, this isn't fair. We were supposed to be up there. I'll never see another wedding like this. I don't know what you did with Tyrion Lannister that made Cersei want to punish you, but it never should have affected me like this. You just don't get it, Sarah. I've been fighting for my family's lives here, and what Tyrion Lannister did for me, it may have saved them. Whether you have a seat at the wedding just isn't as important. That's right. Fuck you. I see. <laughs> well, I hope it was worth it. Because you don't know how furious Marjorie is at you. And I don't care. When I was getting her dressed for the wedding, she was talking about who she could replace you with. <gasps> oh, no! I probably shouldn't have even told you. But I suppose you have a right to know. I can handle this. She's only thinking about it, right? There's still time. It's funny how things change, isn't it? It must be hard for you not to be the favorite anymore. Sarah. Look, it wasn't too long ago I was asking for your help with Marjorie, and you were there for me. Maybe now I'm in a position to help you. Ah, because I you helped her in the first ask. episode. Aha. Otherwise, Marjorie's going to make you leave King's Landing. You're pushing her to it, Mira. Thank you, Sarah. I could really use a hand right now. I don't want to do this all alone. Don't worry. We'll figure this out. Mm. I'll beg Marjorie if I have to. I'm not letting her send you home. Look, the pie! Oh no! They're already serving the pie. Oi. We're missing Oh everything. no! I know you. You were in the gardens the other night with Damien. Before he disappeared. I have a few questions to ask you. What were you doing there with him? Mira? Don't think I don't know it was you. You've made a mistake. Oh, oh shit. Seven hells. <laughs> you there, girl. I need a towel or a wet cloth, something. Lord Morgren. You'll need to find someone else. I'm not finished Are with you her. you sick, man? You think I have time to bother with handmaidens? Release her, or I'll have Queen Cersei find you another job. Ha! Ah. Fuck you. This is all set up. He did this on purpose. Well, I just ruined a perfectly good shirt to come to your rescue. Yep. He knows about it. No need to explain what that was all about. We all have our own mischief to hide. Why would you want to help me? Well, I didn't do it merely for your benefit. <laughs> I have a nice hard cock. Um, why? <laughs> you want to see it, don't Perhaps you? Perhaps I recognize a kindred spirit. It's not every little handmaiden who can steal an ironwood decree with the crown right out from under my nose. Ah. Consider me impressed. My partners... I am afraid to say, felt rather differently about it. You flatter me, my lord. I'm only saying you have potential, my lady. Your problem is, you still think like a handmaiden. Do you even understand why Tyrion gave you the Ironwood deal? Because it wasn't out of the kindness of his heart. He wants something else. Lord. Right. He wants something from me. Access to Marjorie. Or... Perhaps he just knew he could get the cheapest iron. Very observant. You are no mere handmaiden. I remember what it was like to be new to this game. You feel like you're drowning, don't you? But there's no one you can really trust. What you need more than anything is an ally. I could be that for you, Lady Mira. Is that something you'd be interested in? Oh boy. An alliance can mean many things. My lord, I would be a fool to say yes without knowing what I was saying yes to. Ha ha! Wisely put. So, let me be blunt. Circumstances have put us at odds. But what if we were to work together? Control the price of ironwood together. Collusion! We could get very, very rich 
together. Market collusion. Or should I go back to Blood Michael? This is illegal now. Who has proven to be very interested in it? Oh, that's right. This is when Joffrey dies. Nice. Cool, he dies right in the game. Good. Of course, now it means that the, the, the wood deal won't go through because they blame Tyrion for it. See, they arrested Tyrion. What happened? Oh. Joffrey's dead! I'm afraid it just became a very bad time to be linked to Tyrion Lannister. <laughs> Tell me that you got that Ironwood decree from him before the wedding. Oh no. He said it was waiting for me on his desk. <sighs> what a shame. Such potential. Damn it! I'm afraid any chance of our alliance has become quite impossible. Oh great. You understand. Lady Mira. Get the decree. I can get it. I'll get it back from his chamber. That would not be an easy task. Especially now. Fuck it. Do it anyway. Were to disappear. Perhaps we could talk again. Aha! Uh -huh. We gotta go find this decree. Some stealth gameplay. You have a good head for business, Lady Mira. It'd be terribly disappointing to see it on the end of a pike. Metal Gear Mira! She must sneak to the office! Do -do 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 -do. <laughs> Time for stealth gameplay! Quickly get inside the cardboard box! Here we go. Listen. It's locked. You're not getting in this oh, way. Oh, fucking shit. Tom! What in seven hells do you think you're doing up here? What are you thinking? You've got to leave. Now. Tom, I'm in trouble. There's something inside I need to get. If I don't, it's going to be a nightmare. Damn it. Whatever trouble you're in could be trouble for me too. That's right. Better get our asses so what in there. we do? What's he gonna do? Climb out the window? I have an idea. Shimmy? The terrace. The what? I could maybe climb across the roof and drop down onto the outside terrace. It's just. Oh, I don't know, Mira. Is whatever's in there really worth risking my life for? It's not just kings who die stupidly around here. Tom, I really need your help here. I can't do this alone. Just be careful. Wait here. I'll be at the door before you know it. He's gonna fall, isn't he? <laughs> Whoops! He immediately- he doesn't even get out the window, he just falls immediately. Wah! <laughs> Whoa! So much for that. Just what do you think you're doing here? You shouldn't be anywhere near this place. I yeah. work for Lady Marjorie. Queen Marjorie. She asked me to wait here. Somehow I find that hard to believe. Well, fuck you. I'm not going to ask you again. Oi! Whoever's in there, I command you to open this door at once, in the name of the king! What? You! Don't move! Uh, uh, you just told me- you just told me to leave, and now you told me not to Tom, move. It's <laughs> me! Hurry! Gods, that was close. I almost didn't make it back down here. Some tiles on the roof came loose. Almost lost my footing. Tom, we have to hurry. Find I'm a stupid for a contract. Piece of paper. A royal <clears throat> decree. Well, go on. That Lannister guard could be back with help any second. I'll keep watch outside the door. Tom! You now I gotta find this. it. Where is it? Where's this stupid decree? Nothing? He said that it would be on his desk. And it's not, of course. Nope. Well, let's the ledger. Bill for the wedding. The bill. This is more money than I could spend <laughs> in a lifetime. Holy shit. Is that it? Oh, nothing. Just a letter from Tywin Lannister. Fuck Tywin Lannister. Oh, oh, another bloody letter. Mira, we're running out of time. Tyrion's strongbox. Oh, it must be in here. I think the Lannister guard is back. It's the other one. Damn it! Hide! I find a way to distract them. 
Hide now. What the fuck? I'm telling you, Phew. I heard someone in here. Search the place. We'll find them. And after. Uh -oh. Now that we've got the imp's keys, we can have a little look inside his lockboxes. Ah, we <laughs> needed those keys. Aye. Huh. He actually started a fire. Get the keys. Hurry up. Hurry up! She's the one who says hurry, and she's taking her sweet time. <sighs> you did it. How? I lit a tapestry on fire down the hall. I bought you a minute. Hurry! Oh my god! You. Taking your sweet you time! <clears throat> I, think, I think it has to be in here. It has to be. No, no, no. Just hurry. Oh, for the love of God. <gasps> it worked. Is this? Oh, thank the gods. Oh, I found it. Finally. Let's go. <coughs> Got it. Why did you catch the bastard who? Oh, bring their bloody neck. Well, we got it. Whew. That was a close one. We're not far now. Gwyn Whitehill may already be there. What is this? Our ironwood trees. It's the Whitehills. You see what they've done? They ravaged the land, look. This track was hundreds of years old. We've no time to waste. We must take back what's ours before all the ironwood is gone. Aye. The White Hills need to answer for this. And Gwyn needs to answer for this. But we need to find out what she knows. She'll be over there. Be cautious, my lord. This looks safe. <laughs> if she go around her father to help us, she must have some purpose. She's taken a risk in meeting me. Let me hear what she has to say before I judge her reasons. Of course. Just be wary. You see what our family's done here. Here. You might want this. You may have known each other since you were children, but this could be a trap. Hmm. Doesn't hurt to be careful. Go on. I'll stay with the horses. It's kind of fucked up the girl who, you know, in the beginning, thought was like gonna be his, his, uh, you know, his wife, and now all this shit. Look at this. It's not enough to take our wood. They must defile our homes. Yes, they're assholes. That's what assholes do. They defile things. Why would I want to look at any of this? Wood cutting equipment, White Hill wagon. Why do I care? <laughs> I don't want to look at wood cutting equipment. The old well, yeah, I want to look down the well. Split beams, cracked wheels, shoddy workmanship. Clearly white hill. Oh, a dead girl drowned decades ago, turned into a ghost. It's on videotape. Looks Swell. good. Could be closed. I remember hiding down there, playing monsters and maidens with little name and, and, and Megan. All right. Why is he holding the dagger? we sharpen the dagger. Take some time to do it. Here we go. Mini game. Hmm. I can still smell the sawdust. <laughs> Hear the whining of the grindstone. Such a part of my early years. So long ago. Damn, your early years were fucking boring. You're standing in front of a grindstone. And my axe. I wanted to look at the axe. What happened? Instead, it did this. I see you haven't lost your warrior's ways. 
That's good. Oh, that's not the girl who was going to marry. With someone careless. It's someone else. I guess he knew her when he was a kid or something. Hello, Gwyn. It's... It's been so long since we've met, Roderick. It has. It was before your father found out about you and Asher. Oh. Before he stormed Iron Rock. And that's why Asher was you saw my father's uh, banished. Work there, didn't you? Hmm. And he won't stop. He means to do that to every inch of your land. I have to stop this. It can't go on. I know. You have to trust me. I don't agree with my father's ways. <sighs> I wasn't sure you were even going to show. We're taking a risk, meeting like this. Unfortunately, it's the way it has to be. I'm glad you came tonight. It's good to see you. And you too, Roderick. I think we can help each other. But first, I... I've heard news of Asher. That he plans to return to Ironrath. Why is he coming back? I loved him once. I longed for Asher to come back. But not like this. How do you know about my brother? That's... Part of why I'm here. Uh oh. But I need to know you've come for the same reasons I have. I want peace between our families. No more wars. No more bloodshed. Is that what you want to? No! I need to hear you say it, Roderick. <clears throat> will you work with me? Yes. Peace means my family will be safe. Of course that's what I want. The years have blessed you with wisdom, Roderick. And it is good you have it. Because peace is the only hope your family has. My father is just waiting for an excuse to attack. Why do you think he sent my brother? So there will be trouble. Hmm. My father will bring utter ruin on your house. So we made the right choice Unless then. You let Griff feel like he's in control. Just like you kissed my father's ring. You must show the same respect to Griff. I'll put on a good face and let him think whatever he likes, if that's what I have to do. It is. Hmm. Lord, a band of riders approach from the north. Seven hells. My father's guards must be tracking me. If they catch us here, they'll kill you. Then we've no time to waste. Let's get on with it. My father is planning to make a move against your family. I don't know all the details, but he's been sending a great deal of gold to someone in King's Landing. Hmm. I fear for your family, Roderick. You may think you've nothing more to lose. He is ready to show you otherwise. Why are you telling me all this? Is it meant to frighten me? To make me bend the knee and bow my no, head? No, of course not. Although that's what my father wants. And he knows you can't fight him. He knows exactly how weak you are. What? How? Because you have a traitor in your council. Oh, Someone shit. Someone who knows every detail of your circumstances. Wow. Please tell me, who is it? Who's the traitor? I don't know. We know you're planning to rescue Ryan. Even if it means abandoning your home to Griff. What? There My father's know. guards are close. Damn. I need to know you'll do what I've asked. Promise me you'll submit to Griff. If you want peace between our families. You have my word, You have Gwyn. to do it. I'll do my part. I'll also interrupt your sentence. Thank you. My lord, those riders are nearly upon us. We have to go. What I told you. Be careful what you do with it. And remember, I'll hear about it if you don't. Lord? Come along, Duncan. Hmm. Interesting. <laughs>